in today's video i'm going to show you how you can add to google factor authentication on ces.io exchange app this helps you to guide and protect your fonts okay from online fraudster or hackers out there okay now without further ado let me show you how you can protect and guide your account now to get started open your ca.io exchange app and head over to this top section here okay so once you click on it just like this it's going to take you to this page now scroll down to this section that says two factor authentication okay now click on it just like that okay it's going to take you to a brand new page now click on google play store if you have not installed this authentication app okay but if you have it already you can click on next now for those of you that don't have it you need to click on google play store okay now once you tap on it just like this it's going to take you to this section where you need to install this google authentication app all right now it's going to be taking you about 3.5 mb to actually install this app now click on install to download the application on your mobile phone now we need to give it time to successfully download or install on our device to go ahead and set it all up okay so let's give it time to install all right now you can see it's actually installing so we need to give it a few more seconds to successfully install okay so once you click on open it's going to take you to a brand new page and this is what it actually looks like click on get started okay and when you click on get started it's going to take you to a brand new page again all right so this is the email select the email you want to use for this google authenticator right now click on continue if that's the right email you actually want to use okay now when you click on continue it's going to take you to the main dashboard right and because of security purposes it's showing blank okay because you can actually record the screen right now all you have to do click on enter a step up key a setup key right now it needs to add the name of the key right so since you're using ca.io now need to write cas.io all right now once you have done that you need to head over to this section that says your key okay now we need to head over to ces.io to get our key all right you need to keep this key private right because the, someone can have access to your account with this key okay now click on next all right so once you click on next it's going to take you to this section now you can see this is the key that starts with g right so copy it and head over to the google authenticator right so that way you can paste it on this section that says your key now you can add it up and click on add it's going to actually save the key okay now head over to c.io again and click on proceed right now when you click on proceed you're going to see this section here now go back to your google authenticator to get this code okay so it's not going to be showing this because of security reasons like i said now copy the code right it has a timer that runs out make sure to be very fast about that okay now click on proceed once again and you can go ahead and paste the code and just like that you have successfully added your two google factor authentication now to check it out let's head over to this section once again and if you scroll down here you can see that the two factor authentication has been enabled right you can see that so this is actually how you can easily set up your two-factor authentication to be able to protect your phone from online hackers okay if you find this video helpful please do it to like and subscribe and if you have any question do it to comment down below